Okay, so the first thing that we're going to show you today is how we actually make this material. It's based on natural cork. So what we have here is the actual uh, material as it is in nature. So you might not be aware of this, but the cork that's used in bottles and the different things comes from a tree bark. This is the actual bark, okay? And so if you look here, we can see what the uh, overall structure is. And as you can imagine, you know, this is watertight. It will float. Uh, another interesting factor is it absorbs shock, and so it's perfect for acoustic isolation. And another feature which uh, is not too known about cork is that it isolates heat. So all of these features are used with our uh, super stress by coal. This is what we all are aware of. This is the uh, top for a wine bottle, in this case Rioja, which is another famous uh, Spanish advent. And uh, if we actually look closer into the actual bottle, if I chip away, you'll see the same type of structure that we saw with the tree bark. Uh, why do we use this cork? Why is this product of interest for you? Uh, because we are located in Granada, Spain, and Spain produces 98% of the world's cork. And so we really don't have any competition to this product. It really is singular, and you're not going to be able to find this anywhere else. And so if we can just come closer here, we could actually see what the actual material is when we start to work with it. We grind it down into this uh, grinded uh, version. It's the same as what we had before, except that now this is ready for use uh, as a building material. Okay. 